Hey everyone, Paul here again, and I am here with Dave, who joined us on the last blog video where we were talking about the new series that he is writing about focusing on the right stuff. And today, Dave, we are talking about information transfer. So tell us what you got for us. Yeah, that's right. Thanks, Paul. That's what to, you know. this week's blog is all about. And the importance of having a system to equip team members with the information they need uh, not only to succeed in their role, but to ensure that, you know, customer and, and job related requirements are consistently and successfully being met. And Paul, you know better than I do, information flows in and out of the organization in all kinds of different ways through the sales and production process. And so because of that, we need a system to deliver the key data points to the various teams uh, so that they're being successful and client uh, specifications are, are being met. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, machine shops and any kind of manufacturing, precision manufacturing company is just a whirlwind of minutia of tiny details that are so critical to the manufacturing process. I always say there's like a thousand ways you can get a job wrong and everything has to align to get it right. Um, and uh, yeah, information transfer is, is essential. If you're trying to do that on paper, it's so impossibly difficult to get it all right and have it be efficient and timely. So yeah, I appreciate these, these insights and thoughts you've put down here. I know people will get a lot out of it. Um, and we look forward to the third installment where we're gonna talk about a fun phrase called super summaries. So a sneak peek on that. But um, yeah, thanks for all this, Dave, good stuff. And we'll see you on the next blog. Thanks, Paul.